Hey, what's going on everyone? Fast Food Toy Reviews here. Today we have EA Sports Madden NFL set of 32 toys released by McDonald's back in 2014. Now it's a mystery to me. I'm not sure what teams are in what bags, so we're going to have to open them up and have a closer look. Alrighty, so I cracked open the first bag and inside there are some little NFL mini figures and some other stuff in here. So let's see who we got. And it looks like we have the Carolina Panthers, you know, that's cool. And the Buffalo Bills, look at that. So who could that be? So we'll say that is, who's a Buffalo Bill? So we'll say Jim Kelly and a Carolina Panther. We'll go with uh, Luke Keekley or Cam Newton. Let's see what this reads in here. So inside, let's see some advertisements. So we got sign up to play flag football. And then it looks like you can, let's read this, print your very own Madden NFL play sheet so you can print out some stuff. And then here is a whole entire checklist of all the different teams. And then it looks like we have some stickers here. So let's see. So we can take this out, Get my giant finger in there. There we go. So we'll take the Buffalo Bill. And it looks like you can give them whatever number you want. And it also has some emblems and the Madden NFL logo. So you can take the Buffalo Bills <clears throat> logo and we'll place it on the side of his helmet. Let's see if we can do that. Oh, so tidy. We'll try to do it from this side here, a little easier. And we'll get it lined up just right. Oh, there we go. Well, they don't stick all that well, but that is okay, just to give you a sampling of what we're going to do. And there we go. So it's a little off. And then we'll make him <clears throat> one of my favorite players, Jim Kelly. So we'll make this guy number 12. So we'll put the one on here. Just like this. And there's the one. And then we'll grab the two. Let's see what we got. And we'll space it out just a little bit more. And, well, good enough. <laughs> a little crooked. So there you go. So there is number 12 for the Buffalo Bills, Jim Kelly. And we'll just say this is Luke Keekley. Very cool. Alrighty, let's see who is in this one. So we're not going to spend a lot of time doing all the stickers for all these guys. But, looks like we have the Jets and the Saints. Okay, let's have a look. All right, get off of there. So, let's see. So, the Saints could be, who's it going? Michael Thomas. So, we'll just say this is Michael Thomas. And for the Jets, we'll say this is, who's a good Jet player? Like, one of the most famous New York Jets of all time. So we'll say, even though it doesn't really look like him, because he kind of looks like a linebacker, we'll say Joe Namath. So we have Michael Thomas. But this guy looks like he's throwing the ball. So it could be Drew Brees, I guess. But I like Michael Thomas, because he's awesome. So there you go. It's the Jets and the Saints. Okay, who do we get next? Let's see. And let's see who we get. And it looks like... We have the Detroit Lions and the Kansas City Chiefs. Now, one of the all-time greatest Chiefs, Derek Thomas. Legend. Legend. And Ricky Rodney Pete, Barry Sanders, go on and on with the Detroit Lions. And it looks like they're just repainted figurines. If you look here, there's no articulation, so it's just like repainted and recolored little molded figures. But this one is cool because it reminds me of Derek Thomas. So that is a win. Okay, so let's open this one. Maybe we'll get something a little different. Okay, okay, here we go. Looks like we got the Atlanta Falcons kicker. So we'll say Morton Anderson. That's cool. It's got the little football there. I like it. So we'll say Morton Anderson. And who is this? So this could be... Well, we'll say Drew Bledsoe or 
some other Patriots. There's not very many famous Patriots out there. Um, let's see. Jimmy Garoppolo used to play for the Patriots. I can't really think of any. Oh, of course I know. It's Tom Brady. Come on, everybody knows Tom Brady just won the Super Bowl. So, yeah. So the Patriots and the Falcons. We got a kicker and it looks like another quarterback. Cool. Let's open it up. Who do we get? And we have the Miami Dolphins. And the Seahawks, Richard Sherman, Russell Wilson, the Dolphins, Dan Marino. And let's see, every time I see Dolphins, I think of Ace Ventura. <laughs> That's good. Oh, good stuff. Not a fan of the Dolphins. I'm a Bills fan. I don't like the Dolphins. And this one's cool, though. So, yeah, that, that's definitely a nice one. I like that that pose. And this one's okay <laughs> because I'm a Bills fan. So, there you go. It's the Seahawks and Dolphins. Now, we're going to crack this one open. And let's see what teams we get this time. This is actually lots of fun. I like doing this. I wish more sets would do this. And let's see. Oh, okay. So... Good stuff here. So we have the Packers, Aaron Rodgers, and the Tennessee Titans. So who's a good Tennessee Titan? Let's see, Eddie George, the legendary Steve McNair, rest in peace. And just so many Packers. Brett Favre, <laughs> Aaron Brooks, back in the day. So, yeah, I like these ones. This one's really cool looking. I like the way he's catching that ball. Ah, uh, reminds me of, like, Odell Beckham. Ah, the one-handed deal. So that's cool. So there you go. It's the Green Bay Packers and the Tennessee Titans. Ooh, what do we get? Let's have a looky. And all right. Look at this. Look at this. The Redskins. The Washington Redskins and the Denver Broncos. So let's see. John Elway. Top five greatest quarterback in the history of the NFL. And, oh, geez, where we start? Redskins. I think even Bruce Smith played for the Redskins, but there's just so many players that played for them. Art Monk is one of my all-time favorites. So we'll go with Peyton Manning and Art Monk for the Broncos and Redskins. Or Bruce Smith, because he played for the Redskins at the end of his career. So these are really cool. I like this pose. You know, I like it. I like it a lot. And there you go. Redskins, Broncos. It's a mystery. Who did we get? Who did we get? And inside. Ooh, okay. I like this one. So we got two legendary teams. And we have the Steelers and the 49ers. So we have Roger Craig, Joe Montagna, Steve Young. Oh, and who's that other guy that used to catch balls? Oh, what's his name? Jerry Rice. <laughs> Probably the greatest NFL player of all time, or at least top two or three, Jerry Rice. And then with the Steelers, oh, we'll just say that's Big Ben Roethlisberger. I don't know. There's a lot. Franco Harris. There's so many Steelers. Antonio Brown. Juju Schuster Schmidt. This is great. <laughs> Can you tell I like football? Yep, I like it, the football. So there you go. It's the Steelers and the 49ers. Mystery. It's a mystery. And who did we get this time? This one feels a little bit different. Uh-oh. Look at this. I like it. I already like it a lot. So we have the Cardinals. Name a famous Cardinal. I think Kurt Warner played for the Cardinals for a minute. And of course, one of my all-time favorite players, who is a definite first battle hall favor, Larry Fitzgerald. And then we have the Dog Pound Cleveland Browns. Who's a famous Cleveland Brown player? Name one. Let's see. I like Baker Mayfield because he's new and fresh. And he's making the Browns relevant again. The dude is awesome. So look at that. I like that. That's cool. So we have the Arizona Cardinals and the Cleveland Browns. And let's see what we get here. This is fun. All right. Who do we get? Looks like we have... Ooh, this one's got a little dust on it. So we have 
<clears throat> the Giants with dust all over it. So we'll clean that off. And this one's got a little dust too. The Houston Texans. And we'll go with JJ Watt. And wow, if that's not if that's not Odell Beckham, I, you know I don't know who that could be. Look at that. That's like that's like the perfect representation. That's the one-handed catch. That's oh, love it. So JJ Watt obviously strip sacked, recovered a fumble, run it in to the end zone, and you know some guy named Odell Beckham. So there you go. It's the Giants and Houston Texans. Well, we got to open it, and we got to find out who we get. We're narrowing it down, so if you're paying close attention, you'll probably be able to guess the last couple of toys. And so we have, let's get this put away. So we have the Buccaneers and Baltimore Ravens. So we'll say that's Warren Sapp, who's in the Hall of Fame. And let's see, we'll say Ray Lewis or... Who's another famous? Well, I think Ray Lewis, who's awesome. So we got Warren Sapp and Ray Lewis. <laughs> That's great. That's a cool pose. Almost Heisman-ish pose. And then that would be like a typical Warren Sapp pose where he's smacking the ball out of the air and dominating the offense. This is cool. So there you go. It's the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and the Baltimore Ravens. We're getting down there. Only a few left. Who are we missing? And we have, look at this, we have the Jacksonville Jaguars and the Philadelphia Eagles. That's right, the Eagles won a Super Bowl. That's great, I wish the Bills would win a Super Bowl. So Jacksonville Jaguars, remember Mark Brunel? Who remembers Mark Brunel? And let's see, for the Eagles, you know, of course we got Carson Wentz, but Randall Cunningham. I grew up watching Randall Cunningham as a kid. So that's what we're going to say. Mark Brunel and Randall Cunningham. <laughs> I'm just naming off some of my all-time favorite players from each team. So there you go, everyone. It's the Philadelphia Eagles and the Jacksonville Jaguars. So who didn't we get yet? Any guesses? <laughs> all right. Open this up. And there we go. And it looks like we have another kicker or punter. We have the Los Angeles, well, at the time, San Diego Chargers. Oh, the Purple Pe People Eaters. We have the Minnesota Vikings. So we have a punter slash kicker for the Chargers. So we'll just say it's the San Diego Los Angeles Chargers of California. <laughs> That's crazy. And the Minnesota Vikings. Name a Minnesota Viking. Name one legendary player from the Purple People Eaters from back in the day. Who is a legendary Viking? Or just name anyone. I don't even care. Can you say, let's say, Dante Culpepper, Randy Moss. Yeah. And for the Chargers, of course, LaDainian Tomlinson, legend. And Philip Rivers, of course. So there you go. The Chargers and Vikings. We're getting down there. We're getting down there. Let's see. So, here we go. I was wondering when we were going to run into these guys. So, we have the Chicago Bears and the Indianapolis Colts. So, Andrew Luck, Mike Singletary, uh, Peyton Manning, um, Mike Singletary. <laughs> oh, I love the Bears. Dick Buckus, Mike Singletary. This is awesome. Madden NFL, EA Sports, no name of the teams on there, but you don't need the names. So there you go. It's the Indianapolis Colts, and we'll say Andrew Luck, Marvin Harrison, Peyton Manning, Reggie Wayne, Edger and James, or Edgar and James, however you want to pronounce it, and we'll just say Mike Singletary. <laughs> so there you go. Bears and Colts. Let's open it up. Come on now. Who have we missed so far? Who is in here? And it's... Look at this, two legendary, iconic teams of NFL history. We have the Raiders. Do we want to say Oakland, Alameda County Coliseum? And then we have America's team, the beloved Dallas Cowboys. That's right. Look at that catch. So who is a famous cowboy? So, of course, you got Zeke and Dak and then, you know, like 
just tons of Raiders. So this could be Howie Long, because he's one of my favorites. We'll say Howie Long for the Raiders. Oakland Raiders, Los Angeles Raiders, and the Dallas Cowboys. And this could be, name a famous Jason Witten. I think that would be a good representation. Tight end, Hall of Famer. There you go. It's the Oakland Raiders and the Dallas Cowboys. This is it, folks. Who's been paying attention? Who knows what's in this? The last two teams remaining. Who is it? It is... Who is it? It is... The Cincinnati Bengals, and this guy fell out, and he's all dusty too. We'll dust him off. It's the St. Louis Rams, Los Angeles Rams. It's just the Rams. So we'll say, that's a cool pose. One of the all-time greatest players in the history of the Rams organization. We'll say Isaac Bruce, catching a pass from Kurt Warner, and a Bengal, Anthony Munoz. Boomer Esiason, Chris Collinsworth. <laughs> There's so many Bengals <laughs> in the Rams, Bengals, Bengals, Rams. Oh, good stuff. So there you go. It's the Los Angeles Rams and the Cincinnati Bengals. Very cool stuff. So there you have it, everyone. EA Sports Madden NFL set of 32 wonderful little toys released by McDonald's back in 2014. Now, this is an absolute gem. If you're an NFL fan, a sports fan, you like collecting all these little novelty toys, you're going to want to get this set. It's just a complete win. It's fun to display. And each set comes with stickers so you can put the, your favorite player on there with their favorite number and all that good stuff. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. We'll see you next time.